and welcome to a realistic and busy week in my life as a software engineer. I spent a lot of time on Sunday redecorating my house. I finally got the coffee table arranged nicely, but I particularly wanted to focus my energy this week on making my backyard patio look nice, especially with the weather warming up. It looked really ugly and the way that I set it up made it look smaller than it already is. So I grabbed my dog and we headed over to Home Depot. As you can see, he was pretty nervous and was shaking, but he quickly got acclimated and eventually tried to escape his leash three times, so don't feel too bad for him. He got lots of smiles and compliments in the store, which he was completely unfazed by because he's used to people fawning over him. I ended up picking up a lemon plant and this outdoor rug. As you can see, even just rearranging the furniture opened up the space a lot more and made the patio look bigger. Monday started out very gloomy, which was on theme for how my workday went. I was very busy trying to work on my application Spring Boot 3.2 upgrade, which turned out to be a lot harder than I had anticipated. Well, at least the list of errors is smaller this time. <laughs> Around lunchtime, my laptop literally shut down, so I took that as a sign to take a break. I went outside and channeled my frustrations into pulling weeds for an hour, and you can tell that I was really going through it because what the hell is this outfit? I ended up making instant noodles for dinner because I had no energy left at the end of the day to cook a proper meal and I unfortunately spent the rest of the night working on my story because at this point I was just so frustrated and I just wanted to get it out of the way. I'm gonna go grocery shopping now and my dog is starting to have a panic attack. He knows once I start rummaging in my closet, that means I'm going to go somewhere. <laughs> well, I came in for groceries and I left with a little bit more than groceries. Okay, a little Trader Joe's haul. Trader Joe's is such an interesting place. I feel like everybody there just seems so happy, so content with their life. And their workers are really nice too. Today, I was my cashier was this gorgeous black lady. And at the end, I was like, you're gorgeous, by the way. And she was like, so are you. Thank you so much. I love women. Anyway, so I got spinach, mozzarella cheese, cottage cheese, guaca salsa, salsa verde and two things of pico and i put all of these in my salads salads are basically the only thing that i eat and then i got three of the cocoa baton wafer cookies these are so good and two more of these wafer cookies i don't know what they put in this is it crack i don't know but it's like Kit Kat but better and of course the best part the flowers so i got this bulb garden with these yellow flowers. I don't know what kind of flowers these are. I got these yellow daffodils. This orange star. Look at the little pot that it comes in, so precious. And then I got another one of these bulb gardens. I don't know if these are tulips. They look like tulips, but pink tulips are my favorite. 
And of course, my favorite, this Monstera plant. They had so many Monstera plants, but this one was the best looking, so of course I had to come home with me. I'm so happy with these. They smell so good too. It's 4.44, make a wish. After coming back from Trader Joe's, I worked for a couple of hours. I find it pretty difficult to film in depth about my workday since this is what it looks like for the majority of the day, sitting in front of my laptop. And I find that it can get pretty monotonous. I ended this day by going to Lowe's in the evening to look at some plants. It turns out that this Lowe's location has a cat named Lois and she was super sweet and friendly. Hi Lois! Hi! <laughs> there was a plethora of plants but a lot of them are toxic to dogs so I couldn't get as many as I wanted. I had started the past two days immediately working as soon as I woke up, I decided to start today off by cleaning up around the house a little bit instead. It had been a hectic past few days, so I had let my house fall into a little bit of a mess, and I'm a firm believer that a messy environment translates to a messy mind, and I felt so much better after cleaning up. I then got started on building this outdoor shelf for plants that I got off of Amazon. Some of the plants that I have can be toxic to dogs if ingested, so I got the shelf to make sure he can't get into those plants. I just want to say a big fuck you to the wind for knocking over my pot of daffodils. <laughs> fuck you, wind. Thursday was so busy that, to be honest, it completely slipped my mind to vlog anything. I reviewed my code changes with the team, refactored my changes, and started another round of testing. I'm also going to be presenting to my manager's manager's manager on Monday and I had to finalize the presentation contents. I didn't get any clips of me working but my sofa did arrive so I took a break from working to assemble my sofa. So this is the before and this is the after. I feel like the space is so much more open and inviting and I actually want to spend time out here now. I'm looking forward to adding more plants in the future once I can prove that I can keep my current ones alive and growing my knowledge of gardening. I just noticed that my zinnias are already starting to come up. There's one right there. There's another one right there. Oh my god, I see four. It's so fast. I was not expecting to see anything for a month. Hold the door. Tiger Rose at my parents' house. Oh my goodness. Look at the little 
god! <laughs> Look at his butt! <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> I picked the flowers from there. Want me to? Do you have a long? Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs>